Get dumb, but faster. Good, I can stop doing it. Look. No, 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 no. That's the deliveries. I think I need two of them, I think. Um... I got it. I remember my favorite dish. There was a tavern in the castle town that served an exquisite lamb stew. Normally I would prepare my own meals, but that dish in particular I prefer to pay for. The first time I saw you eat sheep, Adrian, Adrian, Andrew, I thought I had been thrown into the queerest of dreams, all to think the good sweet gentle shepherd would gobble up his friends with such delectable delight. Well, being a shepherd is more than being a friend to sheep. Your duty is to ensure no part of their life goes to waste. You milk them, share their wool, and run day, yes. See that their skin becomes leather and their bodies nourishment for others. We shepherds rely on our sheep for survival, especially in such unforgiving climes. So I did my utmost to repay their sacrifice with as happy and comfortable a life as I could provide. I believe they were happy anyway. They say happy sheep provide better milk. Indeed, the cheese I made from their yield was quite popular at their at the tavern. 
It paired wonderfully with ale. In fact, I once I remember one acquaintance of mine downing their weight and drink. How oh, delighted were they by the combination. Their dwarven friend was perfectly applied appealed or applied. Scouting them something awful. Uh oh. Oh no. Here's a lala fell. Oh, well, haven't, haven't you had your fun by now? <laughs> Never enough fun, eh? Not when it's with you. Oh, Big Andrew is strong and lovely, but Little Andrew is adorable and lovely. Adorable? Oh, don't think you can simply flatter your way out of my discontent. Even though you very well may. <laughs> Hey, satisfaction up. Just and generous journey. Journey, journey, and yet still, there's still much work to be done to regain both memories and true form. To that end, Erin has another favor to ask you. Look, looking at little Adrian reminds me of how true Adrian was. Once so enraptured by dwarven beards. Do all fluffy things fascinate you, Andrew? Oh, the beards! Yes, for the longest time I assumed they were naturally grown for the chin. So I was surprised to discover they, that they actually actually attached at the helm. As an amateur artist in myself, I cannot help but admire such unique dwarven handicraft. Hmm, what did I say then? Why did I say that? Was I an artisan? I do remember sitting before the harp, harp on snowy days and making something handicrafts of some sort. Does that sound probable to you, Ronnie? Mm -hmm. Updated the view a new list. Okay. Pixie time! Uh, we got the rest of my memory any moment. Any moment. So we could dump three of them in. So I think next week. So next week is when. Hang on. Hang on, I'm gonna make my life easier. I need at least 150. I'll do 250. I need 2,900. <laughs> there we go. This is really not the way to do this, by the way, but it's the only way I know. If I'm right, next week should be, yeah, next week should be done this.
Na na. Boasted a high population of artisans who crafted armor and weapons and all sorts of little things. I have no doubt a master craftsperson stands somewhere in these flowering fields, a leaf man forever dreaming of creation. Wow, lovely. You have my gratitude, Ronald. And that's, that's it for the week. That's it. That's done. Hmm, <clears throat> I haven't much of it, but feel free to snuggle a sheep or two before you go. Or maybe cheer a little else. Yep. Yep, tomorrow. I mean, that Tuesday, pretty much, coming Tuesday is, will be the last bit of it. Alright. So hold on a sec. I need to go back to my apartment. Um. That'll be it for that. Just get the flop for that. Um. Um. Alright, give me a moment. I need to stop the stream for a moment. It's being weird. I'm gonna see if doing that will fix the upload for sure. At least the part I'm seeing on my side. <laughs> 